Hello, this is a demonstration of my Perspective Aware collaging tool made as a final project for CS29426 computational photography. In this demo, I will create a collage out of these images taken from various web sources. Assembling these images together using only affine transforms produces conflicting perspective cues. Each image has its own local perspective cues, but in general, there is no guarantee that these perspective cues will agree with one another globally, as illustrated here. To fix this problem, my new Perspective Aware collaging tool automatically corrects the perspective of each image as it is moved around in a virtual 3D space. See the paper for details. Before I can start using each photograph, I must label its perspective cues. This is done by specifying three sets of orthogonal lines, one for each 3D basis vector. The collaging tool automatically solves with an appropriate camera matrix using convex optimization. This is repeated for all the remaining images. Once all the images are labeled, we can begin making the collage. We start by placing all of our photographs into the virtual 3D space. Note that we don't do any explicit 3D modeling here. We are only using 2D perspective transforms to create the illusion of 3D movement. Here, I move this potted plant around in the 3D environment. However, in order to ensure that perspective cues are maintained exactly, we can only perform 3D linear transformations with the camera at the origin. For this reason, 3D translations can only be approximated with 3D scaling. The background is also a photograph and so it can be scaled to create more floor space. This approximation works reasonably well for artistic photo collaging, so I can easily assemble this collage by specifying 3D motions, which my program then approximates with the appropriate perspective transforms. Although the objects appear to be moving in 3D space, what we are seeing here is achieved only through applying perspective transforms to the original photographs. No 3D models are constructed here. Here we see the final composition.